Every month, more than 100 people are hospitalized with serious burns. Most are children needing life-saving skin transplants. In terms of donor skin, um, we've run out of donor skin for quite a while now. I've been waiting for more skin for a few weeks, but there's just simply no donors. Um, the doctor says the shortage is affecting the quality of service to patients. We have been using um, a pig-derived substitute, which is not a bad product, it's a good product, but like I said, is inferior. And then there are also other um, synthetic products which can be used, but none of them compare to human skin in terms of efficacy and in terms of patient recovery. The Center for Tissue Engineering as well as the Organ Donor Foundation are appealing to South Africans to register as organ and tissue donors. It's a simple two-minute process and anybody can donate tissue, which includes skin. Skin have to be donated once you are deceased. And then there's some practical implications. Skin must be procured within 36 hours of death. So it's, it's a bit of a challenge. So we need to do a huge amount of public education to make people see and understand firstly the need and then the fact that they can do something about it. Each year, only about 200 people register as tissue donors in South Africa. Aisha Ismail, Cape Town.